Hey there, and welcome to Learn WordPress. In this tutorial, you will learn about some of the improvements that have been made to the Create Block Theme plugin during WordPress 6.3 and 6.4. Create Block Theme is a WordPress plugin which extends the functionality of the block editor for theme developers. Not only does it allow you to write any changes that you have made to your theme in the site editor to your theme files, but it also allows you to create a new theme from scratch. If this is the first time you are learning about Create Block Theme, you may want to check out the Streamline Your Block Theme Development and Manage Your Block Theme Fonts with Create Block Theme Tutorials, which cover the basic functionality of this plugin. One of the improvements that has been made to Create Block Theme is the addition of theme font previews. When you navigate to the Manage Theme Fonts page, you see a list of all the theme fonts that are installed for the current theme. Clicking on the arrow next to a specific theme font will show you a preview of that font. You can then select different options in the preview type dropdown to see how that font will look in different contexts. The options include heading, sentence, and paragraph. If the installed theme has more than one variant installed, you will also be able to preview the different variants. Additionally, it is also possible to change the demo text and see the preview live. And you can also change the demo size. Another addition to the Manage Theme Fonts page is the Theme Fonts Overview on the right-hand side of the screen, which also includes the total size of the installed fonts. This font preview is also available when you add a font. For example, if you choose to install a Google font, you will be able to preview the font before you install it. Additionally, as you select variants, the variant list is updated on the right-hand side, along with the total font size. The other addition to create block theme is the ability to trigger theme-related actions from the site editor. If you are editing a theme in the site editor, there is now a new wrench icon in the top right-hand corner of the screen. Clicking on this icon reveals the following four Create Block Theme actions. You can save the current changes to the theme files. You can export your theme. You can edit the theme metadata, like the theme name, description, or author. And finally, you can create a new theme based on your current changes and either save it or export it. This means that you no longer have to save your changes in the site editor and then go all the way back to the Create Block Theme page to save or export your theme. And that wraps up this tutorial on the improvements that have been made to Create Block Theme. Happy coding!